Whether it's the 1980s or even today, Christmas is the most wonderful time of the year. And what better way to celebrate it than by taking a look back at some of the totally awesome 80s cartoon Christmas specials that you might have forgotten or didn't even know existed. So grab your Snuggie and some eggnog as we take you back in time to remember 20 forgotten cartoon Christmas specials that were on TV in the 80s. And starting off the list, Yogi's First Christmas. When Yogi Bear is awakened from his hibernation by Christmas carolers, he decides to join his friend Snagglepuss, Huckleberry Hound, and Doggy Daddy for the Christmas carnival at Jellystone Lodge. But an old hermit and bratty boy named Snively wants to scare away guests and ruin the annual Christmas event in Jellystone National Park. But not if Yogi Bear can save the day. You finally get to see his first real Christmas tree. With popcorn strings and sparkling things that he helped decorate. It's your first real Christmas Yogi Bear. Number two is the Christmas Raccoons. In this prelude to the TV series, The Raccoons, Bert, Melissa, and Ralph Raccoon have their home stolen when their house is cut down to become a Christmas tree, along with the forest trees disappearing. Number three, a Snow White Christmas. This film's plot revolves around the return of the Wicked Queen who is unexpectedly brought back to life during Christmas and casts an evil spell that freezes the entire land, where only Snow White and her friend Gronion escape. Now, mirror on the wall, say it! I am the fairest of them all! The younger Snow White still lives! An interesting fact about the special is that Snow White in the movie is the daughter of the Disney princess Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Number four, BC, A Special Christmas. Set in prehistoric times, two cavemen create a myth based on the idea of giving presents to each other. Finding out that they can make some money on their story, the two cavemen create a figure that develops into the first Santa Claus. Number five, Trolls and the Christmas Express. In this Christmas special about six troublesome trolls that aren't very friendly, they actually decide to sabotage Christmas by sneaking into Santa's village disguised as elves. To really wreck Christmas, we've got to go where it all starts. Right here in Santa's village. They try hard to wreak havoc on Santa's workshop, and they even keep the reindeer up all night so they're too tired to deliver the presents. Number six is a chipmunk Christmas. One of my favorite Christmas specials growing up, we get to see Alvin being both caring and thoughtful when he decides to give away his favorite harmonica to a sick little boy. But this is actually the harmonica that Dave once gave to Alvin. So Simon, Theodore, and Alvin have to find a way to get a new harmonica before their big concert performance at Carnegie Hall and not let Dave know. Some of the chipmunks' most famous Christmas songs are actually in this special. So if you love Jingle Bells, Deck the Halls, and their famous chipmunk song, Christmas don't be late. This is a must watch for Christmas holidays. Number seven, Christmas comes to Pac-Land. You might already know that there's a Pac-Man cartoon in the 1980s, but there was also a Pac-Man Christmas special before that. When Santa loses all his presents from his sleigh over Pac-Land, Pac-Man and his family decide to help Santa Claus find the presents so they can deliver them by Christmas. Unfortunately, the ghost monsters Inky, Blinky, Pinky, Clyde, and Sue, they try to steal the presents. Number eight is Ziggy's Gift. The mishap prone Ziggy, who is best known for his popular comic strip, he gets involved with the street corner Santa scam that collects money, but they don't give it to the needy. But even though Ziggy is trying to spend Christmas Eve doing good deeds, a cop thinks that he's actually trying to keep the money. And to make matters worse for Ziggy, a pickpocket wants Ziggy's collection kettle money too. Number 9 is Yogi Bear's All-Star Comedy Christmas Caper. In this Yogi Christmas special that's produced by Hanna-Barbera, Yogi escapes from Jellystone Park and hides out in a department store posing as the store's Santa. This special boasts an all-star cartoon cast with the likes of Hulkaberry Hound, Hokey Wolf, Quick Draw McGraw, and even Fred Flintstone and Barney Rubble make an appearance. I didn't know you had all that talent, Yogi. Well, uh, you know the old saying, Cindy. Still water runs deep. That ain't funny, but it's philosophical. Number 10 is Mickey's Christmas Carol. In Mickey's Christmas Carol, it's a cartoon adaptation of Charles Dickens' 1843 novella, A Christmas Carol, and stars Scrooge McDuck as Ebenezer Scrooge, along with his loyal employee, Bob Cratchit, who is played by Mickey Mouse. Number 11, The Christmas Tree Train. It's about two bear cubs, Buttons and Rusty. They take a ride into the city on a train, 
then they get lost and they have to make their way back home before Christmas. Number 12 is Deck the Halls with Wacky Walls. It's an animated Christmas television special based on the Wacky Wall Walker toy line where a goofy crew of extraterrestrial wall walkers journey to Earth in a quest to learn the meaning of Christmas. Number 13, Cabbage Patch Kids, First Christmas. You decorate a tree and hang stockings on a turkey. You've got it all wrong, Kenley. During the Cabbage Patch Kids toy craze of 1984, Ruby Spears created a Christmas special to add to the fun. In a story where the Cabbage Patch Kids travel to the city to learn about the Christmas spirit, they encounter a lot more than they bargained for. Number 14, The Glow Friends Save Christmas. In another cartoon special based on a toy line, The Glow Friends Save Christmas is about the Wicked Witch of the North Pole who tries to ruin Christmas by capturing Santa Claus. In this special, Carol O'Connor plays Santa Claus and Sally Struthers plays the Wicked Witch. You might remember them from the hit TV show All in the Family. Number 15, for better or for worse, The Bestest Present. This popular special is based off the popular comic strip, For Better or For Worse. During a rainy day before Christmas Eve, Michael and Lizzie are taken by their mother to go shopping. When they return to their home, they discover that Lizzie's stuffed bunny is gone. Number 16, Babar and Father Christmas. In this Babar Christmas special, Babar goes to find Santa and get his country added to Santa's Christmas route after he finds out that a letter that was written to Santa was never received. Father Christmas, why don't you come to Celesteville uh, before Christmas? You could use a rest before that long journey, I'm sure. Number 17, a Garfield Christmas special. Christmas means presents, lots and lots of presents. What would an 80s Christmas be like without having a good old Garfield story? In a Garfield Christmas special, Garfield, John, and Odie, they go to John's grandmother's house for Christmas, where Garfield finds a present for John's grandma that just might make you tear up a little bit in the end. Number 18, Santa Bear's High Flying Adventure. It's Christmas Eve and all the children around the world are dreaming of the toys Santa Claus will bring. This year, Santa Claus has asked Santa Bear to deliver his toys to the South Pole where they have never celebrated Christmas. This obscure special is only 23 minutes long and it's pretty hard to find, but you'll be surprised at how popular it was and actually really is. For number 19, we have the Care Bears Nutcracker Suite, which is loosely based on the Nutcracker Ballet and is a Care Bear special that is made up of a three-part episode series, later made into a special. When the evil vizier takes over Toyland Castle, a Nutcracker enters the real world and recruits the Care Bears and their friend Anna to help him. Number 20 is Christmas in Tattertown. This is a story about Debbie and two of her toys that get transported to Tattertown through a magic book. It was supposed to be the start of a 39 episode series for Nickelodeon called Tattertown and it was going to be aired in 1989. The project was abandoned and this 30 minute Christmas special is all that remains. And with this list I hope you were able to find at least a few 80s Christmas specials that you might have remembered from your childhood. But if not, there's no better time than now to start watching some of these timeless classics that you may have forgotten about. Be sure to let me know if I missed any and tell me which ones were your favorite from the list. And let me know in the comments down below.